Hi everyone, what's up? It's Joshua here from Alternative Brewing. Today we're gonna to be brewing coffee using the Wakako Mini Presso NS. Now, the Mini Presso is a handheld brewing device with an integrated pump. It comes along with its own brewing cup, a cleaning brush, and packs away into its own soft carry bag. The NS is an abbreviation that means it's exclusively suitable with Nespresso compatible pods. And if you're looking for a compact travel alternative where you don't wanna be taking ground coffee along with you, or you generally really prefer the convenience or the flavor from pods, then the Mini Presso NS is a great choice to go with. But you can check out and shop the full range of Wakako Mini Pressos, like the GR, which uses ground coffee, or CA for the Cafe Italia pods in this link right here. Let's jump right in now though and brew with the NS so you can see how easy it is. The first step is to screw the brewing head off from the Mini Presso body, and then place an NS compatible pod foil facing upwards into the body of the NS. Screw the brew head back on nice and tight here, making sure that you screw it down all the way as this will also act to perforate the foil of the pod, enabling you to brew through it. Next, unscrew that water tank and fill this up with 70 mils of boiling water, stopping at about one centimeter from the top of the tank. Screw the body back firmly onto the water tank to ensure there's no leaks, and then it's time to brew. Flip the mini presso over your cup and then release that piston by screwing it open and then begin steadily pumping it to slowly build the pressure. And you're in control of the flow of the espresso and the speed at which it brews with each pump. It's a nice one pump a second that I found gets the best results. And continue to pump until there's no more espresso coming out. And once you've finished, that's it. It doesn't take all that much time at all and you can choose to drink this straight black or add some milk to it for a delicious home latte. And in cleaning the mini presso, it's as simple as removing that spent pod and then throwing that away responsibly. I would suggest running a warm water cycle through the mini presso to clean out any remaining coffee and it also makes sure that that pump stays clean. Rinse the cup and the rest of it underwater before drying it and placing it all back together. And that's the Wakako Mini Presso NS for you. A convenient and super portable brewer that'll easily brew your favorite coffee. I've even heard some people say that it brews better coffee than their home pod machine. I'll let you be the judge of that one. So if you have any questions on the Mini Presso NS, throw them in the comment section down below and we'll get straight back to you. Don't forget to hit that little bell icon on your screen and then that way you stay notified when we bring out new videos just like this every week. If you've enjoyed this video, Hit the thumbs up. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.